Another trend that we're doing a lot of is an encaustic look tile. Now this is an encaustic look. So there are true encaustic tiles and the difference is that an encaustic tile is a true cement tile and is hand painted. Um, it's a tile that has a little bit more maintenance involved to it in that it needs to be sealed both from the bottom and the top because the design on a true encaustic or cement tile can sort of wear off over time, which is part of its beauty, but at the same time, um, it's you you wouldn't want to put it in an area that was going to be uh, had high foot traffic without being sure that it was a sealed product. The encaustic look tiles, however, are usually a glazed product, which also helps with their um, care and maintenance. Um, you would treat it very much like you would any other tile. So the encaustic look is just a great trend um, right now, and they come in all shapes and sizes, all different patterns. Um, and some of that sort of thing. And we may have some photos later that we can look at just some other patterns. Where um, might you use uh, a tile like that? That's really extraordinary. It's almost like art. Where might you use that? It is. It's very much an art feature or a very much a focal point. Um, those are going to be beneficial in on backsplashes. If you had a backsplash that you wanted to have a little bit more of a focal point or even as um, an accent uh, above a, a, a cooktop of some sort, that could be used there. I also do it um, on shower walls. And I do it on bathroom floors as well, and in laundry, wow. a laundry room. A lot of people yeah. like to add something just a little different to a laundry room to make that mundane, routine place a little more fun. <laughs> and so um, they, I do it often in a laundry room. It's more of a confined space. It's limited in its in its quantity. So it's not going. It's something that you even if you change some of what you do in the rest of your home ten years from now, that tile can work for you. Mm -hmm.